Here's a design I made in pattern nodes. I started with a line element, uh, used the grid, um, played around with some different functions here, and just wanted to create this uh, drawing that I could take over to the AxiDraw. Uh, in my process right here, I'm gonna export this uh, as a PDF. Just call it pattern nodes. Uh, this should be fine. And then I can open this up in Adobe Illustrator. One thing I wanna do is, uh, before I take it to AxiDraw, I wanna make sure I don't have like the border on this or just clean it up. And here's the that drawing, that image in Adobe Illustrator. And what I like to do is just get rid of this border. There's just, you know, the, the canvas almost. Uh, because otherwise the axi draw will draw that as a border. Uh, so this looks okay. Um, I can save this as a, a PDF and uh, yeah, I'll just save this. I'm gonna take it over into the axi draw um, and from there just position it onto the paper, maybe scale it uh, and then just start plotting it with the axi draw. In order to start using the axi draw, I'm actually gonna import that PDF file into Inkscape. Uh, and from there, I'm gonna um, reposition it onto the page, scale it down. I'll go over to the Axie Draw controls and uh, just start plotting from here. Depending on how complicated your file is, this might take a while. Uh, so I've just sped up the footage here. Here the file's almost finished. And after a little bit of time, you can see the final result. It does look kind of like the image we created in Pattern Nodes. There are a few areas where the ink isn't quite consistent, but I sort of like those imperfections in the end result.